the chamber's been breached. Protect the diamond. <laughs> well, cousin Rooster, for the last time you get. My name ain't Rooster. It's Lord Diamond. You hear that, boys? Rooster's called himself Lord Diamond. <laughs> <laughs> the diamond did not choose you. You ain't a man. You half a man. You a half man, half nothing. Y'all are wrong. And I'll show you. I call upon the ancient word. Lord, I'm coming home to you. My name is Flika. Get in my squish machine. I will chop your heads off! Team, time to work on our battle cries. I'll go first since mine is the best. I'll chop your head off! Sakurang, go! I'm gonna whip your head off with my sock arm! Nice! Ralph Wrinkles, go! I'll send my robots and they're all gonna bite your head! Better. Flute cop, you're up. I'm gonna make noise and it's gonna hurt your ears and then I'm gonna punch you in the nose. Great! Wexter! <laughs> Love it. Gray Diamond. I don't have one. That's the worst battle cry ever. No, no, no. That's what I'm saying. I don't have a battle cry. Honestly, I wouldn't worry about it, buddy. It's not like you have any powers, proper training, or fighting skills, so you don't need a battle cry. You're right, Flu Cop. I guess I don't have much of a purpose here. And you know what? I'm not one to hold my best friends back. So you guys keep fighting crime, and I'm going to go find something else awesome to do. What? You can't leave the team. What are you going to do for money? Oh, don't worry about me. Old Gray Diamond here. He lands on his feet. Whoa, did Gray Diamond just quit? Because he doesn't get unemployment if he quits. I told him that. You look so dumb with that big diamond on your head, bro. Guess I don't need this stupid thing anymore. Welcome to my pawn shop. What can I pawn for you today? What's up, bro? I got a big diamond on my head, and I gotta pawn this ASA possible. Hmm, where'd you get that, Ace? Well, my low-energy friend, pull up a chair, because I got a story that's going to blow your head off. You see, people didn't always call me Gray Diamond. No, no, my parents thought Frankenstein was a pretty cool name, so they called me Mark Frankenstein. Wait, your world-renowned diamond expert, Mark Frankenstein? Oh, wow, I haven't heard that name in years, bro. <laughs> I lectured on some of the most controversial diamond theories of my day. The legendary Grey Diamond holds unlimited power. Whoever possesses that power can do anything. Tomorrow we're going to pick up on how diamonds can tell you your destiny if you listen really closely. Whoa! Hey, Sergeant G, my old partner. High fives! I thought they were shipping you out to the chicken head war. Mark, I need your help. Some miners in Alabama found a diamond. The army wants to cut it up and sell it to get rich. That doesn't concern me. I'm a professor now, of children. My diamond hunting days are long behind me, best friend. No, no, don't worry about it. No, I, I understand. Oh, and by the way, that diamond they found, it's gray. 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 Oh, bro, the gray diamond. <laughs> Nobody's been able to pull this diamond out. I guess we're just gonna have to cut it out. Stop right there. Nobody cuts this diamond. Mark Frankenstein? <laughs> no one respects you or your crazy diamond theories. Now stand back. Cut through them if you have to. No! Uh, what the heck? Uh. But turns out the Grey Diamond has no powers <laughs> at all. Like, zero. <laughs> yep, just kind of a cool hat, really. Great story. I'll give you $15 for it. For $15, you can have the outfit also. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pass on the suit. Nice. American History Museum, how may I direct your call? Hey, buddy, you're not gonna believe this, but you know that diamond you keep calling about? Somebody brought it in. I never called about it. <laughs> 
I'll be right there, city boy. What do you have an axe cop? Do you have babies? Babies? <laughs> no. Good, because they're disgusting. My mom used to make me eat them all the time to stay healthy. No. Oh, and for you... <laughs> What the heck? The souls of everything are getting sucked up, and they're heading downtown. You're not going anywhere, soul. This is the best fifteen dollars I've ever spent, bro. My going on? Someone's got to stop all this. Where's Axe Cop? Lord Diamond, you're supposed to be on display at the American History Museum in the ancient Alabama exhibit. I was laying low, biding my time till I get my hot little hand on the Great Diamond. And with the power of this here Great Diamond, I'm gonna be half man, half everything! <laughs> Theory was right. Diamonds can tell you your destiny. You must stop half man, half everything from getting Axe Cop's soul. Me? But I don't even have a battle cry. I'm just a regular guy that used to have a giant diamond for a head before I pawned it for $15. The Great Diamond chose you to protect Axe Cop. It's your destiny. I have a destiny? And it's to protect Axe Cop? Yeah! Best destiny ever! All right! I already got a destiny. Thank you. It's my destiny to protect you. Oh, that's a great battle cry. I protect Axe Cop Soul. <laughs> Nailed it. Hey, want to hear my battle cry again? No. I protect Axe Cop Soul. Don't ever touch my axe again. 